I'm gonna be straightening my hair for the first time in like forever. So this is my texture. It is 4C with a mixture of other looser textures, but the looser textures are only right here in the back and on the really sides of my head. <laughs> and so now um, the only, this is like the only product I'm gonna use. It is a heat protectant and it like just adds shine and no like weight to it. So I want like a feathery look, so this is gonna help me get it. And so, you know, if you have natural hair that's super kinky, you want to work in sections. So that's what I'm going to do. I can't tell you the last time I straightened my hair. It's been such a long time. And really, I was going to wait till Christmas, but... I don't know, I just, I couldn't wait, couldn't wait. Okay, so the process starts with me combing my hair and you can use your fingers or whatever you want to use, but now I go in and blow dry my hair and I use the tension method. Now that's what this is my first pass with the blow dryer. We're gonna go through again, but I just like to do the tension method because I'm not raking through my hair every single time. And it does get it pretty straight, you'll see. So then I go in and I comb it just a little bit more and then boom, back to the blow dryer. When I'm done with each section, I just go ahead and flat twist it and leave it to the side. On to the next section, we do the same thing, comb it out, blow dry it with the tension method. Comb it again. And then blow dry it again. And see, it does get it pretty straight. And I just flat twist it and I move on to the next section. So basically I did my whole head and this is the last section we're going to be doing. And I use my round brush, okay? So I did that first tension method, but then I go back because I want, I go back with the blow dryer because I want my hair to get super straight without the flat iron, without, you know, super direct heat. So this is what does it for me. I try to concentrate mostly on the ends. And you'll see as you keep going, like it, it'll be like, huh, is this doing anything? But as you keep going, you'll see your hair is going to get straighter and straighter and smoother and less kinky, less coarse. You'll see. I'm doing this with my brush because it's broken. So every time I scoop through, I pretty much have to push it back into the handle. And you can see, like you can compare the two sections. Like this is the one that I haven't touched yet with the round brush and this one I have. So it's much straighter. And this is my whole head round brush out. My hair is getting longer, but I did get a cut a few weeks ago. So that's why my hair is getting braids and stuff. And maybe that's why I really wanted to straighten it because I don't know, I just miss my hair. But the length is kind of blah. I, she cut too much. Love her, it was my fault. That's what I told her to do. But so here we go in the back. Now in the back, my hair is gonna turn out a lot smoother because this is where my looser texture is. My hair is so weird. But here we go. I just take my, uh, what is it called? Um, 
like brat tail comb and then I just comb through it and put the flat iron behind it and I only do one pass and oh my gosh, it looks good. You'll see my like excitement and surprise face, see? <laughs> One full pass. Here's a clearer look at it. This camera does get blurry sometimes, but I have it on this mode not to put like a filter on my face, only because when I'm in focus, it's really, really good quality. Oh, and for my hair, I started at 400 degrees and then I went up to 410 degrees and that's the highest I went. My texture, like in my hair, this is where my texture just starts to change to get a little bit more coarse. And boom, just like that, we're at the top of my hair. Voila, there you have it, a news anchor. I'm pretty happy with the result, honestly. It's like really airy, pretty fluffy. It's not too flat, it's not too puffy. I'm pretty happy about it. More of this heat protectant, like I said, it gives some shine, so I really like how it looks in my hair. Now it's time to wrap my hair. That's what they do in all the silk press videos, so that's what I'm gonna do. It's been a long time since I wrapped my hair, so bear with me. This is me not really sure what to expect. <laughs> and this is me going back to the days I used to have super duper short hair. This is how it turned out, guys. I'm with it. I'm happy. I'm happy with it. So now I'm just gonna like, you know, zhuzh it up, figure out how I wanna wear it. But this is it. Thank you guys for watching. Love you.